we're back. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> oh wow. Okay, now the reset. There we go. Those arms are look quite spooky. <laughs> Really spooky those arms coming out from the ground. They're scarier than the actual undead that we're getting around killing. <laughs> yep. I'm gonna scare them with their own weapons. Well, I'm looking forward to see what other magical uh, tricks and things this wizard has. Oh, you're gonna enjoy the heck out of him, I'm sure. I've seen a freezing AOE that I wouldn't mind. Think of Frost Nova? Yep. Yeah, I think that's the name of it. I like that a lot. And inevitably, I'm gonna be screaming whenever I use it. Right. <laughs> be just stronger than me. Money! Bases around. <laughs> have very deep pockets. I have a magic hat. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of which, the wizard has some great hats that they can wear. Yeah? Oh yeah, you're gonna see, dude. <laughs> Just the animation. I mean, the, the look of it is, is awesome. Shit. Whoa. Ah, we have to go down here, don't we? Mm-hmm. Like how you just fall from the ceiling. Flam! <laughs> <laughs> ah, now I'll get to see how, how randomized the, the dungeons are. Magic. I haven't noticed a whole bunch, but I know they are somewhat randomized. Yeah, we're definitely wrecking havoc. <laughs> <laughs> Magic, shenanigans and stuff. I'm sure the uh, their their exterminator build is gonna go up after I finish with them all. My spiders. <laughs> Ooh, lots of people. Love it, everyone. Need more arcane power. Wow. Does the wizard have any regeneration abilities of any kind? I have to lower the sound a little bit because... Health-wise? Yeah. No. <laughs> Interesting. You're gonna get some armors and stuff like that in the future there. Oh, okay. I wouldn't zombie, mind that. Zombie dogs. Oh, Pudgies! Oh, they're yours! That's mine! New skill as well. <laughs> Defense. Oh, Frost Nova, here it is. Yeah, there you go. Hmm. And it's a very nice skill. I still use that quite often. Good, 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 good. So now we have a few tanks. Excellent! It right here. Yeah, when stuff gets around you, just Ooh, Nova. Like Wait, <laughs> Nova away. Wait till the, the, the mobs become a bit bigger. The frost animation is great because they'll be in the middle of an attack uh -huh. with a big sword about to chop your head and you hit Frost Nova and they'll just pause. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have enough arcane power. I get carried away with this laser beam. I just drains all my mana that's another thing that's which... from what I'm concerned with with my sorcerer is fight to fight so if there's a big one naturally you focus fire on that but allow yourself to drain out all the way oh. See, like this encounter just blow them away with all the DPS you can throw at them and just now watch yourself regenerate and you'll you'll be ready for the next fight by the time you get to it huh. if it's big you kind of have to ration but yeah. other than that you get nuts hmm, I like this Ooh, there's a tough guy with heels and stuff coming out. Ah. 
<laughs> I don't want to be near. I don't have enough arcane power. Man, use person spiders. <laughs> My character screams when she hasn't got enough uh, power. <laughs> she yells at you. Yeah, her voice is really loud. It's the monster one. Her voice for the characters. That's better. Before. She hasn't said it now. Oh well. <laughs> <laughs> I get. I really get. I have to get used to your spiders and dogs and all your various other spooky stuff because I keep fighting, thinking there's monsters and it's your dogs or your spiders. Right. <laughs> Yeah, everything has an outline. When you mouse over it, that's um, that's attackable. Like that scribes. Electrum. My name is Lockdown. If, if you oh, can and interact with it, you'll just Once the go. captain of King the Oryx army, I left only to honor my land and my king. No man has a greater love for his king than I had for mine, even as I drove my blade through his dark and corrupted heart. Okay, good for you. But it sounds Scottish on this game. Yeah. <laughs> and and Lagdanon sounds like a yogurt brand. <laughs> <laughs> like Activia. Yeah. And <laughs> Three monsters killed by the danger. Oh, good. Nice. It's a bit slow to start with this laser beam. Mm -hmm. It takes a while to activate. I love how you can go across platforms, like right now, look, I'm throwing over the side. Alright. And aim your frost nova down, uh, aim your frost beam down the stairs, watch how it pivots. Ooh. It's pretty cool. It does, yeah. Neat. I was thinking, um, I, I'm usually a bit uh, compulsive about exploring the whole of the map, but since uh, this is part of what has been seen in the, in the beta, I'm fine with just running through until we get to the, uh, the Skeleton King. Oh yeah, that's it's fine, that's dude. Fine, really. However you want to do it, I'm really, really easy. Wow, so much stuff moving! <laughs> <laughs> Take me a while to get used to. It. I've been playing Minecraft for so long that now, uh, not but more graphically advanced games, kind of confuse me a bit. Right. Yeah. If it's not a block shape, it's hard to get used to. <laughs> yeah. I hear you, man. Ow, ow. He's out. Wow. He's teleporting. <laughs> Knocked the piss out of you. <laughs> Smack me good. Beautiful. Now that I think of it, Omega sounds like a good refrigerator brand name too. Yeah. <laughs> Mega Rainbow 3000. <laughs> Refrigeration unit extraordinaire. <laughs> Ooh, good. I've got some regeneration braces. Awesome. I have yet to find... Ooh, magic pants! Sweet. You want a 9.3 magic mace? I do. Okay, there it is. Keen club. Oh yeah, with fire damage? Now I have a glowy stick. <laughs> Even without the great stuff. I don't right. have enough the whites don't sell for much either, so. Nope. What does snare mean? Snared? Yes. Yeah. A snare is traditionally for like, um, you know the, the rope lassos that yes. they put in a tree? And when they spring a trap, it, it that's what they call a snare. Like, uh, or as a verb, it snares them or it traps them. It's, ah, it okay, so it's... Uh, it's almost like root. 
Okay, so when it appears on the screen on, on the monsters, it's because some ability is slowing them down. Right, that's correct. Yeah. Sometimes I forget you're Italian. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I was a good bunch. I was born in the UK, but I lived in Italy since I was one oh. year old. So I've okay. learned both languages, but I don't get to practice English. I learn when I'm playing online. Ah. So that's that's why it sounds maybe better than other uh, non-English speaking people, but. It's not as good as it should be, basically. <laughs> <laughs> you do fine. Like, I would have never known that you were... Um, I, I couldn't have guessed your origin, actually, if I would have, um, if I would have tried. Uh, I've got a really mixed background. English, Italian, Irish, and a couple of my families in France, so... <laughs> oh, okay. My, uh, my, my uh, ancestors were all French, of French origin. Oh. The, uh, my family name is Guillory, and uh, we have big noses traditionally, <laughs> which is a very common trait in the French. Yeah. I actually curse a lot better than most. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> because of their French background, I guess. Uh -huh. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Is this you? Yeah. Okay. It's good you have a bar on yourself because you look scarier than most monsters. Oh. With your position and demeanor and movements. It's definitely scarier than most monsters. They sometimes start attacking you and then, oh no, there's a green bar. That's friendly. <laughs> awesome. Glad to know I'm into it. I hope I strike fear into their horse like yours. <laughs> sure you do. Yeah. It's odd having to get used to using lots of... Whoa, 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 too close. So many skills. Yeah. I think that's one thing that I need to learn properly to use this character more efficiently. Yeah. It will be hard to get used to at first, but you grow into it. Let's see, I got fire bats. Hmm. Okay, I'm trying the shock pulse for a while. Ooh, the arcane all. I like that. Wow. Pretty cool. Ooh, that's nice. Still <laughs> waiting. I've got this. Ooh, a small galaxy. Ain't I like right. that. Oh, yeah. And these. Some shocky, shocky. Yeah. Beautiful. Not easy to aim, probably, but I like them in when when there's lots of mobs around. Right. Okay, so we we'll go down here. The Oryx Passage event: the collapsed hallway. Aha. How oh, minions stay back. Back. <laughs> back, I say. <laughs> the skeleton king. The power of the fallen star awakened me. And soon all will suffer as I have suffered. Gods, bring me his bones. My god, that sounded so much like my ex wife. <laughs> it's the mother-in-law from hell. <laughs> Bats to the face. Hey, I will save you. Man, those bats are wicked. Wow. We have a lot of range. This electrical stuff. Everywhere. More good for groups of stuff. Yep. Yeah, we could stick to the magic missile for a while. At least until I can increase the power of this electricity set thing. I'm guessing I can increase the range and oh, thank stuff you, like that. But why mm -hmm. do you risk yourself for me? You live. Fortune smiles on you, old man. I'm here to bring you back to me. Oh, it is wonderful to hear that Leah is well. I fear the worst. I learned of this secret passage through old maps I found. I guess it's through the Cathedral Garden. Yep. 
So I found my first we pole weapon. The and star. I must say, I don't Christian. mind it very much. <laughs> <laughs> it looks better than I thought it would. I have fulfilled my promise to Leah and rescued her uncle, Deckard Cain. Now, all that stands between me and the fallen star is the Skeleton King, who has returned to darken Tristram once again. I sound like such a voodoo magic medicine man. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle, you're alive! Thanks to you and your friend here. I seek your wisdom. Tell me of the fallen star. The prophecy of the end days surely points to it as a sign that the end has begun. Please, Uncle, not more of your stories. All that matters now is that you're back. And the zombies all around town. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm happy he's back too, but she's she's a bit too skeptical with all the evidence roaming right, around town. Right. Right. Have you not noticed that it's like hell on earth? <laughs> When the zombies are attacking, when half bodies are crawling around and trying to bite your ankles, there is definitely something going on in the world. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's just going, oh, I'll call you and your stories. <laughs> <laughs> Did you not just see that corpse? <laughs> Did you see that lady throwing up people? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, let's sell a bunch of stuff. The skeleton king was once our beloved lord, Leoric. He was driven mad so by been... Diablo's oh, evil. He lost both of his sons and his very soul before he was finally defeated. Now it seems he's risen to plague this land once again. The Oryx should be in the unformed land, yet he stands between me and the fallen star. The key to defeating him lies in his old crown. Seek out our blacksmith, Hadrig. He knows of its whereabouts. Hadrig. Okay. I was about to ask, uh, have you done lots of um, crafting and stuff like that with the, mm, with the guy over here? Yeah, I Don't sure have. Nah. Quite a bit. Okay. Um, I, I, Killed a bunch of like I am. Um, he's level four with me, I believe. And the next sets I need like um, rare drops to unlock the next levels that he has, like pages of recipes and stuff like that. Uh huh. But I've already maxed him out on gold. No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going down this way. Yes, yes. Yes. Don't stop by any of the merchants. Oh, this is. Oh, we have to go and beat up, beat up his wife, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. No, no. That's my wife. She's locked in the cellar like all those who've been bitten. I'm to put them all down. Another Scottish guy. How could yeah. kill my own wife? No problems, we'll smack her around. But she would want you to do it. <laughs> sure, I'll smack your wife for you. Thank you. Follow me. This is an evil game. It's it's true. It's it's so sad. Like, we've become so desensitized. <laughs> See how this big axe works. <laughs> Not bad. Yeah. Ah. My friend, I'm sorry. Need more time. I'm trying again to get extra things, but I don't see them working very much. Your flames are awesome instead. Oh yeah. Good uh, yeah. job. Suck some mana down though. Forgive me. Hmm. Uh, Adric, help me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Somebody kill it. <laughs> oh wow. That fire stuff does quite a bit of damage, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. I'm in your debt. My name is Hedrick. I Amy. need your assistance, Hedrick. I search for the crown of York. I can help you there. It's buried with his chancellor, my grandfather. Yep. 
Wow. I zoomed in on the part that she threw up everywhere. I thought that was so cool. I hope you guys enjoyed that. <laughs> <laughs> the audience is probably like, you sick bastard. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, first you beat up a man's wife, then you take pleasure in a puke. What kind of <laughs> sicko are you? It is desensitizing this game quite a bit. Yeah, quite a bit. <laughs> Ooh, the new thing. The new, new gate. There's a big pack coming this time. Yeah, big, pack. big pack at all. That's the last of them. <laughs> you must think another... you're dealing with some in some rookies. Yeah. Need more arcane power. Delicious level six. Mm -hmm. okay. I got a new skill, which I'm glad because the spiders really aren't doing it for me right now. I want my my poison door back so I can have some range. There we go. Splinters. 60% weapon damage is poison. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I'm missing a little bit of experience and an L level as well. And um, I want to try. If uh, Can you hold on a minute on hitting people? I just want to see how much damage this electrical stuff does. Oh, sure, man. Because I really can't get a feel if it's actually doing anything useful or not. The few times that it does hit, it seems quite effective but it hits hits so randomly do you have your damage bars on my damage bars uh, you can toggle damage bars for your monsters oh no i don't mm -hmm. check your options screen right quick and look into your let's see if i can help him out you guys under options we're going to look under gameplay and then where it says hud uh -huh. you see Display healing numbers, display damage numbers, yeah. dis critical damage numbers. All of those things for me except display health or numbers are checked, which I'm actually going to check that too. I might as well. Um, auto equip items. There's a bunch of different things you can set, but I usually keep all of those HUD things checked. You even see when you're actually healing per point. Like oh, the numbers wow. pop up from your head, so you'll see when you're regenerating and all of that good stuff. Oh, nice. So you can be quite scientific about it all. <laughs> good. Uh, cloth time two. Okay. You can check it out on those guys. Right, oh, there we are. 14 and 16. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, here's some more. 14 and 16 doesn't seem like a lot of damage. Let's see the other ability. Magic missile. Let's see what this does. Still waiting. Oh, shoot it. There we are. 14 and uh, 17. It's pretty much the same damage, but you can aim the missile. Right. Which is... And you don't have to get as close to him either. Yeah. It's not bad. It's an advantage. At least I know. I know what I'm doing at least. <laughs> Other than yeah. just click spamming randomly. <laughs> right. I, that wasn't one of my favorite skills on the sorcerer either. Um, but you'll see when the runes start unlocking, like some abilities change drastically. Oh. So they even the the way they look and feel and operate all together. Oh, there's a door down here. Let's forget that health potion. Ooh. Little cave. I love the the orb. Oh yeah. I'm a bit of a sci-fi buff, so having the ability to launch galaxies. <laughs> I love it. Right, absolutely. Right, here's the Milky Way. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, here will be close quarters. End of so the fallen. Oh, hello. Ooh. Need more time. Yeah, in, the, in these quarters, maybe the electrical stuff can work quite well. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's gold.
Whoops, Where'd sorry. You go? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, <laughs> he's gone. Moving around, grabbing all the gold. A bloody chest. Yeah. I like this blue art skill, man. Feel like a little aborigine. Yeah. La, 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 la. Uh, it reminds me the the mob that I hated the most in uh, Diablo 2. Oh, Diablo 2. Yep. Those little suckers that would come out the woods yes. with the blowgun. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I hated they, those. They they, they killed me so pack. many times. Yeah, and these caves are like these electrical things. They're bound to hit something. Even though the range is short, and hoping I'll be able to make it extend it a bit. And frost. We'll have to see also what people like the most as well. So if you guys watching have any preferences, do comment. Tell me I'm open to changing to make it more beautiful. Oh, I love this galaxy just flying around. I will not drop that one, so <laughs> be warned that even if no one likes it, I will carry on using it. It's awesome. <laughs> no. Yes, this all, all, all this electrical stuff works well in here. Good. Very good. And not you not throwing all those spiders around? I must say, I I quite like it. It's <laughs> more comfortable with that. Okay. <laughs> well, I like. I actually, I like it more too without it. Now I I miss my little arms, but those might come back sooner or later. Oh, another thing. Um, I guess I'll actually wait until our next session to do it, since we're almost out of clothes here. But you've got a um, a couple options you can change. One is called Advanced Tooltips, and the other one is um, a different game mode. Let's see. Actually, we can do it right quick. Let's see here. I believe. I don't it's... have enough arcane power. Let's see what it was. Video gameplay key bindings. Social. Hmm. I forget the actual one of them's advanced tool tips. I really forget what it was. Oh, is in gameplay? Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, elective mode. Elective mode is what you definitely want to do and advanced tool tips. Ah, okay. Under options and gameplay. Show advanced tool tips. Okay, thank right. them both. And then you'll be able to get a lot more customized with your um, with your hotbar. Oh, good. Yeah, if if you like to use two skills in the same category and just map them to different hotkeys, uh, elective mode will allow you to do that. And advanced tips are going to show like the actual percentages and damage and everything else that you get on items. Neat. So a little bit more of the scientific for you. <laughs> Yeah, I think we've gone round. Hmm. Interesting. Looks like maybe yep. a little bit further up the road here. Yep. Oh, we both go through the... What's it called? The altar. The, 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 the enchanting on our right. head. Yeah, if you're in range of a shrine and you click it, everybody in the party that's in range gets it. Good. And of course, there's no mobs at all whatsoever to take advantage of it. Naturally, <laughs> I don't know if it's actually <laughs> programmed to be like that because <laughs> it happens so often to me that whenever I activate a shrine, I just don't find any mobs at all whatsoever. <laughs> Big mobs over here. Oh, hello. Club, another one. I've got gathering gloves. I'm guessing they make me pick up stuff better. Increase gold and health pick up by two yards. Oh, I'll, I'll go with that. And magical boots as well. Magic boots. Okay. I quite like my my pole arm. It was a good suggestion. Cool. 
quite happy with that. Ooh, gold, just slang around like that. Did you kill lots of people? <laughs> yeah, there was a few. I think there's something over here as well. All right. Ooh, uh, yes. Yeah. Level two. Cool deal. And that is going to have to wait till we come back with the next episode, unfortunately. Goodbye. Goodbye, guys.